Hello friends, uh, if you want to use VS Code for the Laravel, come and see this video. I'm going to install the, all the extensions the Laravel developer need for the VS Code. So let's open the VS Code and go to the extension. And the first thing I'm going to install the theme. So Aura. Yeah, this Aura theme here I'm going to use. And also I have one more. So Aura Soft Dark. This one. And also if you want, if you don't want this, go and search for this one IU yeah and this one is very good so if I install this and maybe Mirage border yeah okay so it's, it's up to you which you choose next one I'm going to install the Laravel blade snippets so Laravel blade snippets. Okay. Go and install this one. And also Laravel blade spacer because we are here. And this is just add the colibri braces in the end and up. Okay, go and install this. Also, this one Laravel go to view is very useful. So when you want to go from here to this one, we are in the controller. One more. Okay, so here we are in the controller, and if you if we want to go to this view, just hover it and go there. Okay, the next step is the Laravel extra intelligence. Okay, and install this. Also, if you want the Laravel snippets, this one. So it's creating for you all the the given uh, code. So auto complete. Okay, is uh, very useful. Next one is to install the. PHP IntelliFence, so PHP, uh, sorry, IntelliFence, yeah, this one is very popular, go and install that, and uh, because we are here in the PHP, uh, PHP unit, if you use test, so better PHP unit from uh, Caleb Porzio, who created the Livewire and Alpine.js, go and install that. Okay. Uh, because we use PHP uh, Laravel, so I'm going to also add the PHP namespace dissolver yeah this one go and install that and also i'm going to install the tailwind this is just for the tailwind if you're using the tailwind so i'm going to 
the Titan CSS IntelliSense. Also the Vitor for the Vue.js. And it's very popular, nine, 10, mil 10 million. Okay, so I think uh, we are good with Laravel, so I'm also I'm going to add the icon and just search here if you like the material icon. Go and install that. Yeah, you, we have some icons for of the project. I'm going to install this one. And uh, material icon, yeah. Next one, I'm going to also install the bracket pair colorizer and So we change it he's changed the color of the bracket. So here we have purple, blue in this one if statement, and in the public we have different color, and if we have more, we have also the different color for that one. Okay, I install this, and also if I go to the I'll search for auto and uh, I'm going to install the auto rename tag and it's going to rename when we change something. Also, for example, when we rename from div to the anchor tag, it's going to rename also the end of the anchor tag and auto close tag. I'm going to add it and uh, auto complete tag. And with that, I think we are good to go. And uh, I'm going to open also the shell and install code command in path. So hit enter this one. Okay. And now if I open the item, and navigate in the code directory. And here we have the app. So if I say, yeah, CD in the app, and now I want to open this with the VS code. So just say code dot, and it's going to open this with the VS code. Okay, and here it is. Resources, JS, welcome. Okay, and now if you want, uh, because I don't want this in the, I want to hide all, all, all the things, so go to the view and uncheck this show status bar. Okay, so it's gone. And also this show activity bar and it's gone and now we have the clean uh, vs code all the best friends